Hey guys, and welcome back to Fake Card Friday. So today we are looking at a really interesting card that can go along pretty much Beals' brother, <laughs> pretty much. So this card is called Dragon King of the Shadows, so Beals' brother. It is a dark level 8 synchro dragon effect monster, 2800 attack, 2000 defense. It is made with one dark tuner and one or more non-tuner dark monsters, so... Pretty much everybody who makes builds with the whole plague and malicious can also make it. Oh, and hmm, trying to think of another another deck that runs a dark tuner and a non-tuner dark monster. Hmm, I don't know. Hmm, um, I don't know. Maybe maybe Supervisor Bell with Doom Shaman Tinker. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and look at its effect. Once per turn during your main phase one, you can pay 1,000 life points, target this card, and two cards your opponent controls. Banish the targets. Banish the targeted cards. Wow, that is really good. That is really good. <laughs> but I'm, but it's not done. If this card is banished by its own effect, special summon it during the end phase. Wow. So you you make your opponent go neg two. You know, you just summon this guy. Effect. Take the thousand. I'll banish him and these two, and then during the end phase he'll come right back. And then next turn I'll pay a thousand and him and these two and then he'll come right back. Like wow, that is a very, very powerful effect. Like this guy would almost make Scrap Dragon obsolete in in decks that make Scrap Dragon and if they can make this. Only thing is that, you know, Scrap Dragon at least stays on the field so you can at least, you know, conduct your battle phase. At least it said main phase one. If it said main phase two, that'd be stupid to be like attack. Alright, main phase two, pay a thousand, banish those two, I'm coming right back. But that that's a very powerful fact. But it's not done. It's not done. <laughs> this card is destroyed. Either by battle or by card effect and sent to the graveyard. You can discard one dark monster in your hand and special summon it during the end phase. Yeah. So it's just gonna it comes back from being banished and when it's destroyed and they don't even say destroyed by your opponent. So if you destroy it yourself and you have a dark monster in your hand, you can just simply discard it and it'll come right back during the end phase. A very powerful card for dark <laughs> dark uh, decks that can go into dark uh, synchros with a dark tuner. So pretty much, aka anybody who can go in Beals can pretty much go into this guy. So very, very, very powerful card. Uh, oh, excuse me. I wouldn't mind having it for my Evel deck. Definitely not. You know, I'd run it. You know, there'd be times where I'd just be like, you know what, Dragon King of the Shadows. Yeah, come out, banish those two, and it says banish, not destroy. So you know, uh, it does target, but you know. At least I can banish them, so if there's something that I don't want to destroy, something I just want to get rid of, like a Zen mains or, a, or a, like a, or like a 101 or a Maestro. You know what? No, it's, it doesn't replace Scrap Dragon. This card replaces Dark End Dragon. You know, if you guys have seen my extra deck, I run into one Dark End Dragon, so I can just summon it, and then I can banish something. Well, no, send it to the graveyard instead of, uh, you know destroying it so it's like one of my ways to deal with cards such as you know zen mains and etc like that so you know instead of i just take him right out and put dragon king of the shadows in so you know he pretty much does the same job except better much better and he doesn't even lose any attack for it either and he's stronger and he's better just completely better than dark and dragon <laughs> Alright guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Fake Card Friday. Thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys next Friday with another Fake Card. Thanks for watching.